Road to GH will reveal Willow's experience of feeling like a storm brewing inside her, each thought igniting her from within. Regret gave way to anger, a stinging emotion coursing through her veins. She couldn't accept the truth that Michael, the man who once vowed to love her unconditionally, could turn his back on her so coldly. To her, it wasn't just betrayal, but a denial of her entire self-worth and identity. Willow felt her blood boil as the truth unraveled before her eyes. Michael, the man who had incessantly accused her of being a traitor and a marriage wrecker, was secretly building a relationship with Sasha, her most trusted friend. But it wasn't just a relationship, Sasha was pregnant with Michael's child. This news hit like a dagger to her pride, stirring a fury she never thought she was capable of feeling. Willow's anger wasn't just directed at Michael, but was laced with disgust. He had crafted an image of a wounded man, a victim of betrayal, while doing the very thing he had condemned. To Willow, his actions weren't just hypocritical, they were despicable and utterly unforgivable. He didn't hesitate to shift all the blame onto her while trampling on every value of their marriage in secret. And Sasha? She wasn't just a friend but someone Willow once considered family. But now, the betrayal from both of them turned every beautiful memory into a nightmare. Willow couldn't comprehend how these two people she loved and trusted could do something so vile without a shred of remorse. Willow's rage wasn't only for Michael and Sasha's actions, but also for herself, for blindly trusting them. She felt as though she had been cast as a pawn in a game of lies, meticulously orchestrated by everyone around her. But this anger was no longer a dull ache, it transformed into strength, a resolve never to let anyone hurt her again. Michael and Sasha had shown their true colors, and Willow vowed never to become a victim again. In Willow's mind, the pain and betrayal by Michael and Sasha surpassed the limits of forgiveness. She didn't just see herself as a victim, she felt bitterly and cruelly deceived by her best friend. Willow decided that Sasha, too, would have to pay, that the pain Sasha caused wouldn't be forgiven so easily. When Sasha arrived at the meeting Willow had arranged, she had no idea that what awaited her would bring an end to her web of lies. Willow kept a composed face, but inside, a storm of rage was brewing. As the two ascended the staircase, Sasha couldn't recognize the chilling, haunting gaze in Willow's eyes. In a fleeting moment, a slight push from behind sent Sasha tumbling down the stairs, pain and despair enveloping her. Sasha lost the baby, her dream of a family with Michael shattered instantly. The physical pain, combined with the loss and fear, plunged Sasha into a bottomless abyss. Willow knew she had paid for her mistakes, but now, Sasha would also bear the weight of what she had sown. Willow walked away, never looking back, carrying a pain that had morphed into a cold strength. She no longer felt guilt or pity, instead, there was a strange sense of liberation in knowing that Sasha would never find happiness built on betrayal. In that way, Willow retained a shred of her pride, ensuring that anyone who dared to betray her understood that the price would always be exacted and that happiness could never come easily when built on lies and deceit. Willow's actions, while satisfying in the moment, quickly escalated beyond her expectations. Sasha, though losing her child, didn't crumble, instead, her pain and hatred transformed her into someone colder and more ruthless. Sasha no longer saw Willow as a former friend but as a threat that needed to be eliminated. From then on, their relationship was no longer a rift between friends, but a mortal battle with no room for mercy. Two women, once close friends, were now caught in a dark spiral of vengeance. Both bore wounds that could never heal, not only physical, but deep within their souls. Sharp words, covert acts of malice, and bold maneuvers were all employed in this unending war. Yet, deep inside both of them, a small part still remembered the past, the moments when they laughed together, sharing every secret and dream. But now, those memories only sharpened the pain. In this battle to the death, one thing was certain, no one could truly win, for both had lost what mattered most in their lives.